One strategy is that of cascading resources. Here, resources are made to perform more than one activity before their disposal into the environment. The easiest example is the use of treated sewage in gardening. Another strategy is a design for environment. Here, products and processes are designed so they perform the same function with lower resource consumption through their entire life cycle. The philosophy of industrial ecology can be applied in all areas such as management of agriculture, industry and the environment. If different sections in each local community can adopt industrial ecology, it will be easier for the system level planners to use the concepts at a macro level to plan more sustainable societies. Industrial ecology has a greater importance in developing countries where invariably there is a significant shortage of material and energy resources. The ROI, a not-for-profit entity, has been set up to introduce planning systems and tools based on industrial ecology to policymakers in governments and businesses in developing countries. Located in Bangalore, India, the ROI is promoted by some of the leading persons in the field. Get in touch with the ROI for more details on industrial ecology.